you guys would like to go ahead and purchase cheap and instant pre-transfer GTA 5 modded accounts, Call of Duty recovery services, discounted games, and in-game currencies, then click the link in the description of this video. Yo, what's up Prestige community? It's Glitch Gaming here, and I just wanted to say that it would be sick if you could come check out my channel. So click the link in the top of the description for more videos like this. What's up guys, it's Glitch Gaming here, and to today's video, I'm going to be showing you a solo duplication glitch on GTA 5 Online. So if you are new to my channel, make sure to subscribe and turn on post notifications so you do not miss out on any of the latest GTA 5 Online money glitches. And with that being said, let's get into the video. So just before we start the gameplay and how to do this glitch, I want to qu say a quick few things because it needs to be said. So the first thing I want to say, huge shout out to Obese Giraffe because he let me use a little bit of his gameplay at the end of the video. So make sure to go and check his channel out, I'll leave a link in the description. Also, this glitch is pretty hard so I'm just going to give you a warning straight out there. This glitch can be very hard so if you want to just sit it out and leave this glitch for now, I'm sure there'll be plenty more money glitches to come so don't worry about that. But if you want to get some money now, and do this duplication glitch you can earn quite a lot of money from it so what you will need for this glitch is at least one million dollars to spend you will need a upgraded sultan rs to duplicate you will also need a moc and you could get an apartment that i'm going to recommend but you don't really need it so that's pretty much what you need for this glitch so this duplication glitch does work on xbox and ps4 now it can be a little bit different for Xbox, so I am going to leave a text tutorial for Xbox and PS4 as well in case you're having some troubles and you can just read it up and you might be able to understand the glitch a bit more. So getting into the video, what you will need to do to start off with is order some LG RH8s so you can put them in any garage and the amount of LG RH8s you buy, that's how many you're going to duplicate. So I'm only going to be doing a few in this video but what you want to do once you've got the elegies, you want to order them and then blow them up. So if you're doing, say, five duplications, you want to get five elegies and blow five of them up. So once you've done that, you want to get into your upgraded Sultan RS. But what you can do, and I do recommend you doing this, is buying the same apartment that I use in this video. Because it can become very helpful later on in the glitch. So the apartment that I use is the Alter Street apartment it's 223k you don't need it but i really do recommend it so once you've done that you want to go into your sultan rs and you want to make sure in the alter street apartment there is at least one space empty and once that's all done you want to drive the sultan rs into the moc and this is probably the hardest part of the glitch so if you can't master this part then i'm sorry but this is where people are most having difficulties so what you want to do is go to the Sultan RS and what you want to do is press triangle to get in the car and as you press triangle you want to hold down R2 but only hold it down a little bit just enough so it will drive out so don't fold it down the whole way but you want to hold down the R2 button or RT just a little bit so it drives out and hold the options or start button at the exact same time and what you're going to do is as your player puts his hand on the steering wheel and he turns on the engine you want to let go of the options and RT or R2 button so as you can see my player puts his hand on the steering wheel and the engine turns on and then as soon as that happens I'll let go and if it works correctly you should see that your player will slightly open the door and it will fade into a black screen and what other might happen as well you might get a options menu happen and if you've done it correctly you will know you will spawn outside of the MOC on foot so your Sultan RS will not be there anymore and that's how you know you've done this glitch correctly. Now if you do need more help with this glitch let me know in the comments and I'll make sure to reply. So once you've done that what you want to do is start up your motorcycle club. So just join as a president. And you want to just run over to the road and what you want to do is order from your motorcycle club president. Just order any random motorbike it doesn't really matter. And what you should see is it will not spawn on the first time you request it. So you want to open your interaction menu after about 10 seconds, go to Motorcycle Club President again and just order the bike. 
and once it appears on your map you want to run over to it and just return it to vehicle storage so you're going to press on it return it and it will disappear once you've done that you want to open your interaction menu again and go to more sorry MOC and then you want to request your personal vehicle so what that's going to do is it's going to deliver the Sultan RS straight to you and once you've got it you want to get in it and drive it over to your apartment that you're using in my case it's the Alter Street apartment and this is where you want to make sure that you have at least one space in the garage so if you don't have one space in the garage then this won't work so you need to make sure that there's one space in the garage for the Sultan RS to slot into so as you can see I've drove it in and once you've drove in you just want to go back out of your garage and you want to get into your MOC so once you've got into your MOC you want to drag it over to where I am and you want to park it in the exact same position that I park it which is right outside Simeon's car dealership I'll put it on the map at the moment but you're basically going to be parking up on the sidewalk just like this and you want to make sure that the blue circles on the back of the MOC just a little tip for you but once you've got it in place I'll show you on the map right now where it is but this is where the Mars Mutual depot thing so whenever you ring Mars Mutual and you get your car back this is where it'll spawn so there it is on the map just make sure you're parked where I have and once you've done that you want to just get into a random car off the street or wherever don't order one of your cars and you want to drive over back to your garage which you've been using and you want to just go inside of it and this is also one of the tricky parts it's not as hard as the last one but once you've done this you'll be doing the glitch correctly the whole way so once you're in your garage you want to run over to the telly at the back you want to press right on the d-pad to watch the telly and when it comes on you want to press left on your analog stick until it comes to the spectate camera so you should see on the spectate camera it might go to weasel news or something but that's one thing i forgot to mention sorry guys but you must have at least 18 people in your lobby so it must be a public lobby not an invite only and once it goes to a random player in the spectating lobby you want to press right on the left analog stick once and this should take you to a different TV screen as you can see I've gone to a cartoon thing but once you've done that you want to back off the TV screen you want to go to play jobs play heists and join on call and as you can see in the bottom right corner it will say looking for a job and what you want to do is wait until it says populate in lobby and as soon as it says populate in lobby you want to press right on the d-pad so if you've done it fast enough you will spawn into the sky with the TV settings at the bottom right corner as I'll show you in a second and once it spawns you into the sky with the TV settings screen at the bottom right corner you want to quickly press left on the left analog stick and that will take you back down onto the camera screen but I'm just going to quickly pause the video and give you some information about this part in case you go wrong so once you're doing the press right on the d-pad part where you're waiting for the populating lobby if you do it too slow and you actually join into a heist you want to quickly back out of the heist as quick as possible and if you back it out with the person without the person starting the job then it'll be fine all you need to do is go back to your garage and go on to the TV screen again and repeat but if the player actually plays the job and it starts you then you're going to need to restart the glitch again because it will mess it up so if you've done it correctly you press left on the d-pad once you spawn in the sky it will take you back down onto the spectating camera it might be weasel news for you it doesn't really matter but once that happens you want to press back or circle or B to go back off it and then it will then spawn you into your garage and once it spawns you into your garage you should see that you have no mini map so if you have no mini map you've done it correctly if you still have a mini map then you've done it wrong once you've done that you want to go into your Sultan RS that you've been using and you want to drive out of your garage and then drive over to your MOC so at this part I actually did it wrong so thankfully Obi Giraffe has helped me out and he's let me use his gameplay so shout out to him so 
So what you're going to do is drive over, drive your Sultan RS over to your MOC which you parked out earlier. You want to go to Interaction Menu, Motorcycle Club President and you want to return it to Storage. So make sure that's on the Motorcycle Club President, not the MOC return. So once you've done that you want to go into your MOC. And once you're in your MOC you want to go onto the internet and go to Warstock. You want to go to your Mobile Operation Centre and you want to put on Bay 2, you want to put the Weapon and Vehicle Workshop. So this will cost 1 million but don't worry you'll get you'll earn it back much more from doing this glitch but what you should see is once you order it it will go into a black screen and you just want to wait for the black screen to stop and then you want to wait for the mechanic to pop up over there as you can see once he's popped up you can now start moving and what you're going to do from here is you want to get into the Sultan but if you get a timed out screen after that don't worry just accept it and you'll still be able to do the glitch but if you don't get a timed out like alert screen like me that's absolutely fine as well so then last few steps that I've been showing you since you spawned back down to the ground from the TV screen you want to do that as fast as possible so you don't get timed out but once you're at this stage you want to call up Mars Motor Insurance and you want to claim one of the elegies that you blew up earlier so of course you'll have many elegies because you're going to be doing this many times but you just want to call one of them and what you want to do is go into the Sultan and you want to just press right on the d-pad to start changing stuff on it and you want to go to the plate and all you want to do is change the colour on the plate you can change it to a different custom license plate if you want which will save time in the future if you have them but all you need to do is actually change the colour on the plate and once you've done that you want to get out of the Sultan and go over to the control panel just like this and on this MOC you will need to have the rocket thing at the front but once you've got into the seat you want to try and find the elegy that you've called up and you want to blow it up so it can spawn in a few different locations but you should be able to see it on your camera view but once you've done that you want to back out of the control center and you just want to go over to your Sultan again but first of all you want to call up Mars Motor Insurance once again and you want to call another elegy that you've blown up from earlier but as you can see from the elegy that I've blown up earlier that one that I first ordered is now turned into a Sultan RS so hopefully you see what's happening in this video so then elegy RH8s are now turning into Sultan RS's which you can sell later on in the video so all you're going to do now is call another elegy and repeat the process now it can spawn in a few different locations as I've said but you just want to keep blowing them up repeating the process and just keep doing it until you've blown up all of the elegies that you did in the start of the video so there is quite a lot of steps in this glitch and there is quite a lot of stuff that m some people might find hard to do so I am sorry about that and I have left a written version of this glitch in the description if you want to go and check that out and I do recommend you going to do that if you're on Xbox as well but anyways if you don't want to do this glitch that's fine I'm sure there'll be plenty of money glitches coming very soon and of course if there is a new modded lobby glitch I will be sure to post a video on that and I'll update you guys on Twitter as soon as possible if that happens but anyways back to the glitch once you've blown up all of your elegies and you've done the glitch correctly and you make sure that all of the sultans are inside Moore's Motor Insurance you want to claim all of them back so what this will do is it will then return them all to this to the garage that you've got from before which were the ele elegies were in so the elegies that you've blown up whichever garage they were in this is where the sultans will spawn back to so once you've done them all all you want to do is claim them all back and that is basically it for the glitch you've then successfully duplicated all of the elegies that you've wanted to do now these elegies will have the same license plates custom license plates so if you want to sell them what you will need to do is put a new license plate on each one of them before you sell them but that's totally fine it's not too bad to do that but make sure you only sell one every 30 minutes and only I'd say seven 
per 32 hours or something don't sell too many because you might get banned by rockstar and do detected which means you can only sell one car per day so don't be greedy you'll always have these cars in your garages just think of them as an investment so don't worry about that you'll always have these cars so just try not to get banned guys but that's it for this video if you are new to the duplication glitches this is a very hard glitch so don't worry about it if you can't do it or you don't like it if you feel like you won't be able to do it don't even try it because you might be wasting your money if you do it incorrectly or something so hopefully this video did help you guys if you did like the video then leave a like subscribe and until next time see ya Yo, what's good Prestige community, it's Zav or PMHD here. Don't forget to check out the director featured in today's video if you enjoyed it. Sub link is at the top of the description. Check out our previous videos too. Subscribe, stay tuned, stay prestige. Peace.